Okay, hello again and welcome to my channel. Um, I have a request from someone to, uh, actually it's a family member, uh, who requested to see what's in the bag. Um, this is a stationary bag. Um, and you can take it wherever. Just, it's like, it's luggage. Stationary luggage. Um, it was gifted to me as an anniversary present. Um, because the area where I keep all my stationary stuff was really overflowing. And if you can see, there's, like, part of it where I, I keep all the books and notes and all kind of games and toys, books, you name it. So anyway, um, so I was given this and it's, I'm very grateful. Um, this is keychain. Um, I, let's see, what do we have in here? Um, I don't have anything in this pocket right here. Um, this pocket right here is where I keep my journals. Um, my little Chick Sparrow case. <clears throat> my main journal, which I've done a flip through over. And this right here is my faith journal. Um, I'll pull that out. <clears throat> Okay, this faith journal is, um, it says on it, my soul is anchored, and that's why we have this little anchor here, because it correlates with that, so I put my soul is anchored, and, um, this was, um, from eBay, a lady who makes all these inferior Inferia, if I'm saying it right. Um, and it's so beautiful. It's it really is. And this is BRB, which means be right back. And that is that came from a t shirt that I had um, where Jesus is wrote a note and left it hanging on the cross. And it says, um, I'll be right back or I'll be back for you something like that um so anyway um I'll just give a brief show of this okay <clears throat> it's not finished I've only just begun so it still is a work in progress but we have here um the the same lady that made the other stuff. And this is, Lord, keep my heart warm, keep my mind open, keep my spirit intact to always receive from you. In Jesus' name, I pray thee. And it says, because I live, you also live. So, <clears throat> this is cool. I really like this. And so... That goes into this little pocket right here. Um, let's see what else. And this is just a collage that I made um, for this notebook. Let's see if I can get a better view here. Um, <clears throat> never will I leave you. Let's see here. What does that say? Never will I leave you. Never will I forsake you. So that's pretty cool. And so I guess we can go ahead and open that up. And again, we have more Bible scriptures, more little pull tags with, you know, words of encouragement and hope. Um, How's that get back in there? Okay, there we go. And that's just in the little pocket thing. <clears throat> this um, is actually a little dedication to special hymns. My um, 
grandmother used to love to walk around her house and sing hymns. And this is John 3, 16, which is one of the most popular, you know, scriptures. Um, and so, I, like I said, this is a work in progress. So this will be modern um, hymns, spirituals, whatever you want to call them. You know, those songs that you just don't forget. And this over here... Um, <clears throat> It's old time, you know, like old timey. And so here we have It Is Well With My Soul. And we have Sweet Hour of Prayer, Blessed Assurance, The Old Rugged Cross. Um, this was gifted to me. Yeah, I received this as a gift um, from uh, my husband's co-worker. And um, The Solid Rock. Amazing Grace, and there's Gabby. Um, so I've got a lot to fill. And back here is miscellaneous. And <clears throat> this also was a gift. And it's just the preamble, con um, the Pledge of Allegiance, the Star Spangled Banner, Banner, um, Battle Hymns of the Republic. It's just old you know, miscellaneous songs that we sing to honor so much. And then this is just a little bit of, a little bit of uplift, um, relax and play. And so that's what that is. It's just relax and play. Relax, pray, and play. That would, that would be a good one too. Okay. <clears throat> Yeah, we always got to make room for this. And it seems like if whenever I make a video, here they come. So, but I love them. So I love them dearly. Yeah. And, okay, some more cards. These cards are um, little prayer cards. And if you can see up on here on the shelf right there. I have another little box right there of God's promises in that little um, box. And that's pretty cool. I'll sh share them one day, I guess. Um, but this set didn't come from that. And then stickers, labels, boxes, some washi, clips, paper clips. You know, just stuff that I'm going to use. Um, my all new magnets. And this is gratitude with praise. Entering his gates with thanksgiving. Entering into his courts with praise. Um, so this, this is my gratitude book right here. This is the section that is just, is strictly gratitude. And, um, and, just a little personal thing here and then I'll probably write something down here too but <clears throat> and then some more scriptures but these are this is so one page per week um so like I said that's what what this book will be and it's not a lot of paper in this book so I'm gonna probably have to write smaller <clears throat> Um, you know, to make it last. And then some more little things, you know, little personal things and stuff. Now, this right here <clears throat> says venting with gratitude and praise. And this is the section... You know, some more little things here that come out with little messages on them. This is um, where I just vent out. I just talk about whatever I don't like, whatever is bothering me. I just come to the table with the Lord and I just let him know what, what bothers me so much. Um, but by the time I end, <clears throat> by the time I end my little vent... 
I'm reminded of what I'm grateful for and reminded of, you know, well, there at least or but, you know, it's blah, 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 blah. This is wrong. I hate this. But at least, you know, there's always a but. Uh, like, but I'm still hanging in there. It could be worse. His grace is still, is still sufficient. So it's always a, a thanks and a praise at the end. And I'm committing to one vent a week. Um, and more stuff. And here, just some more stuff. You know. And like I said, I'm not finished. And this is this is a very good pen right here. I can't remember um, the name of it, but it's like something... You know like jet pens type stuff it's very very good ink in it I put blue black ink in it <clears throat> so I love the way this writes it's a little fine for my taste I'm more of a bold ink person but this is good for what I'm what I'm using it for for what I'm using it for for this book I wouldn't use this with everything um so again some more flippies positive messages and then here is key scriptures and then here's like a little message and stuff but this is key scriptures and some more flippies I haven't made put in anything for that one yet um <clears throat> and this is categorized okay so we have hope so this is going to be scriptures that give me hope and remembrance more like you know the hope of I am with you always even to the ends of the earth and like I said I'm not done with this I have got a lot of work I'm going to do with this so all of this section is going to be about eternal life eternal happiness with God <clears throat> when it's over it's not over you know um then this one is uplift. My grace is sufficient. So when I'm having a vent going on inside of me or I'm feeling things are insufficient, these, this would be the section where things such as my grace is sufficient will be scriptures that correlate with being encouraged, hanging in there, toughing it out, knowing that I am not in this alone, you know, and so forth. Um, this is the sovereignty section. And this one is, I am the Lord, your God. So here in this section, this is serious stuff. This is going to be the section where um, I write out scriptures that correlate with God and his sovereignty and um, his authoritative manner, you know. When he says no, he means no. When he says do this and not do this, he means it, you know. So that was what that section will be. And then again, here we go with some more, um, you know, little cards and, and different things that will have something written on them. Like I said, I still got a long way to go with with the decoration of this. Getting this together. Um, where is it? Okay, here we go. There it is. All right. So, <clears throat> again, mercy brings you home. Grace sustains you until you get home. So I made that up. Uh, let's see here. <clears throat> Nothing in this pocket yet. Nothing yet. And store some stickers and stuff. Some more encouraging cards. Some more Bible verses and stickers and stuff that I'm still going to use. And this, oh, this is so beautiful. Uh, this lady made this and I got it so I, I wrote some affirmations and different things on it but this is pretty I like this a lot 
And then here's another one with some affirmations and so forth on it. And um, let's see, this is a pocket. And this, I like this a lot. And I got different things, you know. And there's the back part. So I just stick these in here. All right, and so that concludes um, that. Okay, um, let's see. All right, let's go to this side. <clears throat> this side is a, a, a different journal. This, um, I actually got from Amazon, and it is my imitation Hobonichi, um, cousin, I guess you could say. Um, let's see, rest upside down. All right, so, um, take the pen out. Um, this is that C. Coletto pen that I had mentioned in another video that I really like because you buy the base, the body of the pen, um, and then you pick the colors that you want to be in it, and you press this button, and it puts all, and you can put the, you know, the colors in that you choose. Um... And these are the colors that I use most. Violet. This is a nice, rich violet color. Um, this is blue, but it's not dark blue. It's like a really dark turquoise. I mean, really dark turquoise. Um, and this is just your basic red. And this is blue-black. So I have refills for this. Um, I actually like this. I like this a lot. But it is a 05. It's not even an 07. It's an 05. And it definitely doesn't come in 1 millimeter or 1.3 or 1.6. Um, this is just a brain dump journal, which I will probably not use that often. Um, and it's just my little decorations and stuff in there, you know, little cards and stuff, and just, you know, words of encouragement as always. This is your brain dump. You're never too old to journal and keep journaling. And this is just dumb stuff that just came across my mind, and I just, you know, wrote in it. Oh, whatever. Um, so there's a lot of pages that's ready to go. So, you know, I, I set it up. That's the fun part. Setting everything up. And there's some stickers and stuff. <clears throat> I think, um, I wrote where you could actually see the, um, the ink. Like, there's the purple, and there's that dark turquoise blue that I was talking about. That's really pretty. And there's the violet, the dark violet. So, I was testing the pen out as well. So, um, and I like this, this, because uh, you, you can close it with this, or you can put two different writing utensils in it. Now, inside of this cover on cover, the actual cover of this binder is so soft. It is so, so pillowy soft. Um, you almost like don't want to put a cover on cover over it because you can't feel it, you know, but at the same time, it can easily be messed up so uh, that's a good idea 
so there's so here there is nothing in this pocket as of yet and this is just another handle well, I don't know stick something in there um so that's that <clears throat> usually I don't keep that there usually that's just like by the bed but I just I just put everything in one thing this is whatever now this side same thing you got the handle and these are just some extra markers and brush pens that I have um, and um, those will be like the ones I will use up before I use my reg my other ones and in here this is really a <clears throat> makeup case I think um, this is just really extra supplies. This is, you know, inks and whiteout, ink stamp pads and, you know, refills and stuff. <clears throat> so that's all that is. And I just have it there. It's just easy to grab so I guess you could say this is the section where I keep all of the extras like the overstock the stuff you know ah, okay so now there is the big room okay so in here let's see if I can get this thing to stay open all right, for some reason I can't. Okay, so in here, um, usually this does stay open, but I don't know, it's not staying open right now. Let's see, maybe because I got this up. All right, there we go. Okay, so here is just bands, and these are the little decorations that you put at the end of your journal cover these little gold things and then these are paper clips decorated paper clips decorated binders pencil holders metal pencil holders and here's extra these are extra pencils um extra pens and the reason why I don't have the extra brush markers in there is because I really want to just grab them and use them and you know before I use anything else okay in here is nothing at the moment in here on the side is nothing at the moment but on this side is extra paper like craft paper construction paper whatever you want to call it and let's see here and here is just extra overstock of stickers that's all this is overstock of stickers sticker books I have tons of stickers and I do mean tons of stickers so um now, let's see, in here, whoops, let me turn this around. In here is a clipboard. Uh, let's see, that's the clipboard that I use. So that stays in there when I need it. And let's see, just turn it around again. So you can get a good view. And this right here is my, let's pull this out. And we'll get to the other stuff in a minute. This is just pull out of all my stickers. Um, so here's where I keep the, the um, ticket stickers that I was showing before. And these are three different kinds, and this is just paper. 
so that's what that is and in here is everything's categorized it looks like it might be unorganized but really it is um this book right here is all the little small stickers you know they're just small um And it's a variety of different things, but it's just because they're small and they fit in here perfectly. So that's what this book is for. Um, now this right here is a folio, one of those expandable folders. And inside of here, is all the little like squares. All of these are like little square stickers, but they're all stickers nonetheless. But they're all square stickers. And in the very front is little tabs. You know, little divider tabs. And I keep them in the front, but after that it's everything is all square. Vellums, you know, but they're all square. So I keep that in there. And then in here, this, this here is just all paper. All just paper. This is stuff that would have to be glued on. Stuff that was printed, stuff that was actually crafted, you know. So that's what that is, it's just paper. You know, pockets, you know, they just kind of glue on the edges and <clears throat> and then you can stick stuff in it and make pockets with. So that's what that is. And let's see what else we got. Okay, this right here. This is sticker stickers. Now, um, these are a variety of, let's see, this is all one category. This is all plants. Um, and then this is, well, this was, this is, um, the ones that stick out. These are like 3D. Um, I didn't group them together like I did the other section. I don't know why, but I should have grouped these together as well. Oh well, I'll go through it again. And then this is people, you know, a lot of girly stuff. Um, this is my year and um, planner girl stuff like that. Whole bunch of planner girl stuff. And some more planner girl stuff stickers um, I have tons of tons of these um some more letters and, uh, some more letters and smiley faces funny faces <clears throat> I mean this is a, a load I have to put a little sticker up there because there's so many different different varieties of st of girl stickers. I mean, of all shapes and sizes and colors and ethnicities. Just a, a lot. Alright. So, that is that one. And then there's this book right here. This is the, uh, what do you call it? The Antiquarian Sticker Book. I got this off of um, Amazon. I love this book. It's got everything in it that's old Victorian. And then I put a pocket here with some more of my my own collection of stickers. And um, so you've got a wide variety of, and I even use this, like when I'm done with a whole page, then I'll tear this out 
and then I'll use this as a background in a journal which I've done in my big journal my main journal so you've got a lot of pictures pretty colorful pictures I love it. It's, it's, I love this, this book. It's, this is great. And then here's some more stuff, some more stickers that I have. Just oh, this is a wide variety of flowers and, and stuff. That's what my my um, uh, what do you call it? My sticker collection. My themes are always going to be based on flowers, trees, you know, botanist type stuff. Um, it's also going to be faith-based. It's also going to be self-motivation and also, um, uh, you know, fashion, you know, girly stuff. You got to add that in. You got to, you got to add some girly stuff in. It can't be all flowers and, you know, and things like that. You got to add some girly things in there too, you know. And then here is what I really like. Let's see if I can pull this out. All right. When I am sitting on the floor or sitting, laying, sitting in my bed, wherever I'm at, this comes out. Let's see if I can get you to see that. So everything is at hand. I don't have to go digging for anything. Stamps, all my big stamps are in here. All of this, all of my, all this is the ink section. All this is the washi section, and this is the scissors and the cutting and the scraping and the tweezers. All of that is in this section, and it's like, see how it, it is. And I can turn it around. If I need this side and there you go there's white out and there's everything that, that I need erasers glue sticks um, glue tape um, and the reason that those markers are in there is because I've used up all of this these are my main brush pens um, and there's the thin side and then there's the thicker brush side, but these are the ones that I use. These are my main ones. Anything outside of this is extra. And that's why you saw over there um, that there's the extra pen. So those will actually be used up before these will be. And these are obviously too big to stick in there but these are the highlighters and different things that I use so they're always going to be here those are always going to be there um and that's that so there you have it um I can't think of anything else but this is great this is really good good to have it's it was the perfect gift and I'm so grateful for it um it makes everything so much easier and it makes it fun that's what I like it makes it fun because I've been journaling for for years and you know it's it's been off and on because I go through phases where it's just not fun anymore it's just like boring so when there's you have all of these things at your right there for you at your convenience and you can quick grab it's like oh i gotta go get up and get up the scissors or whatever or i gotta go find this where is this it kind of takes the fun out of it but to have everything right there with you um it makes it it makes it a whole lot more fun so i'm i'm truly grateful for this this little setup and like i said it's not perfect i'm still tweaking and rearranging whatever needs to be you know done um to make it easier but um oops sorry but yeah <laughs> now i'm starting to ramble that's it 
I can't think of anything else. So have a blessed day and keep journaling.